What's up, YouTube? I know it's been a while since I made a video, but perhaps a couple days ago you've seen my announcement, if you're a subscriber, saying that, I, um, that I'm aware of that and I have been working on a project. I just haven't been showing it. And now today is the day that I decide to show it. Um, the game work in progress name is called Survival. I can't really think of an exact name. Uh, this is the current startup. Uh, let's click Play. And as you can see, you can play a single player game, join a game, or host a game. The point of survival was, or is, since I'm still working on it, is to kind of enhance and improve my networking skills. And this is actually my first fully networked game. And by fully, I mean like, this is the first game that was meant for networking. It wasn't a single player game, and then I just throw in some network code and hopefully make it work. Um, so let's play single player. And even on single player, what it does is it actually creates a listen server in in another thread. So you're really technically connected to a server even on single player, but it's just uh, on over LAN. You're just connecting to your own server on the same computer. So you wouldn't even know. So I'm currently in game, in case you can tell, and I'm fighting off uh, the first round, which is the slime round. And the goal of the game currently is basically try to survive, that's the WIP name, and and you just go through rounds, different types of rounds. So I'm going to try to get past the slime round, and if it is choppy, uh, Please excuse that, because it's the camera, or the fraps, that's making the game slower, obviously. And since I'm running, you know, a, a server and a client, technically, uh, and, and will slow some things down. But anyway, back in the game, uh, if you look on the upper left, you can see your HP, your gun, which is called, the pistol is called poker. And I just leveled up right there, um, and ironically that's what I'm getting to. Uh, under your weapon is your level, I'm currently level 1, and then under that is your experience. Oh shit. Uh, <laughs> what just happened now is, for each round, and I just died, for each round, when you kill enough NPCs, you get the boss NPC, and then it will stop spawning the regular NPCs, and you just have to go for the boss. But I'm gonna kill off these NPCs real quick, so I can hopefully level up a bit. Let's see. But while I'm killing the NPCs, I'll explain some more. Under the experience, you have cash. At the end of every round, just that uh, again. At the end of every round, you have some time to buy a weapon, and I'll get into that after I kill this slime boss these NPCs. And you get cash by killing the NPCs. And I was actually <laughs> uh, playing this yesterday with my uh, friend online, and it was pretty funny how I just got lucky and I just managed to steal all his kills. So I, I'll probably have to work on that because he didn't seem to really like the fact that I had the highest weapon while he was still in the pistol because I was stealing all the kills. As for level leveling up, what the leveling up does is currently, the higher the level, the more max HP you can have. And with a, and each time you level, you get your uh, HP back. It resets to its max. What I'm going to add is... Um, you need a certain level to buy weapons, because currently you can, as long as you have the cash, you can get the weapon. And I just killed the boss, so I'm gonna just buy the Shredder SMG and just wait for the break time. Nice little GUI that I'm working on. <laughs> and then it goes back in. And now I'm down to 200 cash, and now this is round two, the zombie round. 
Now, one of the cool things, at least cool in my opinion, which uh, I actually just worked on today when I got uh, home from school, is that when you actually shoot at the zombies, instead of before, before they would just eventually just die in a particle explosion, but that was kind of boring. Even, uh, my friend and I got really bored on this. So hopefully to add to the entertainment, now when you shoot at a zombie, depending on how much damage it takes, part of its skin will just fly off, part of its brain, and it enters a new, and it changes to a new sprite. Like what uh, I have right now, you can see part of their brain, I, I ripped off part of its eye. Now what just happened, these big purple things called buff bastards, <laughs> WIP name by the way, um, they're the boss, and during this, uh, ten of these spawn, and they have insane amount of health, and they eventually turn red and actually charge at you, and if you get like a big ball of them, which they're currently in right now, you can pretty much die right when they hit you, so try to look out for them. But right now I'm going to clear out these these normal zombies because they can get in the way and I don't want to try versing the boss while regular NPCs are in the way. As you can see my cash is just really going up with all these kills. So while I'm killing these uh, I'll just explain a bit on the server and about the game itself. Uh, I'm For rendering I'm currently using XNA I kind of made the switch from SFML to XNA because um, of the more possibilities of with the XNA or Xbox ability in XNA, which opens up new ideas. Um, and I don't know, it just seems something new and fun, and I'm currently learning and enjoying it. As for networking, I'm actually not using XNA's. Networking. I'm using the regular .NET socket library because I don't know. I like. I'm used to that. I didn't want to try to overload my brain and just learn a ton of new stuff at once on this project. Just want to just try to do something, and create a game real quick. And if you don't use XNA, I'd recommend it doesn't take that long to learn. Uh, I'm still learning, but I managed to get this done in about a week. So, let's see. <clears throat> I'm down to only the boss zombies, and I actually got a thousand, uh, a thousand dollars, so at the end of this round I'm going to buy me the Thrasher. Now, the Thrasher is a rifle. I really like that sound, by the way. And while it doesn't shoot as fast as the Shredder SMG, it does a lot more damage, making it a better weapon, in my opinion. So, let's see. Now, this is a current uh, round that I'm working on. And, well, every round that I'm working on is currently in progress, but this one is brand new. And it's supposed to be the snow stage, but I need to get more sprites kind of embarrassed to show this, because it's nowhere near done. Even the NPCs aren't done, they, they just bounce around. Um, but these are just supposed to be basic uh, snowballs that bounce around the borders of the map, and if you get hit by one, you take damage, and I plan on adding more things on this. And uh, that's pretty much it. Uh, sorry if it's not exactly what you hoped for, for my long absence, but, uh, what can I say? <laughs> uh, I hope you liked it, um, thumbs up, it, thumbs up if you liked it, it means uh, a lot to me, if you thumbs up my videos, and, peace.